discuss it, you know, rock powder, you rock powder. Because it's in face. I don't rock powder. Like, like, if I rock powder, I go to my hand now. But you brush it. So, which girl do you know? <laughs> so, I leave my hair like this. Which girl do you know? You won't get to go, go, me, go check yourself. Ah, ah, yes, go, you won't spray perfume. Ah, 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 ah,
Anyway, shall okay. Let's let's go to our chances. You know, in this upcoming World Cup next year, World Cup in Russia, man. Is um, Nigeria may qualify. I mean, it looks likely that we are going to qualify. I don't know. Do you see any chances of us qualifying? Yeah, of course. The chances of qualifying qualifying for the World Cup is very large. Yeah. yeah. But they should have done it for me in that last Cameroon match. I yeah. was hoping that maybe they will. They will win Cameroon and then qualify automatically. Mm -hmm. It will be a lot more easier for us, and the stress will just reduce and everything. But now we're looking forward to the next game this weekend. Exactly. Then exactly. Everything exactly. that anything that happens this weekend determines if you're going to the World Cup or not. You understand? So instead of just giving us that, Nigeria will not just give us what we want. Yeah. You understand? We just want to want you to have that hypertension. So, what so what do you think? Have. Can Bernard Road, the Nigerian coach, can he take us? I mean, to big heights in that. What Honestly, for me right now, it, it all comes down to the players. I mean, if they can get their shit together, yeah. they can play together as one, you know. I don't yeah, see why the chemistry would be there. Like, mm -hmm. They understand each other and all. That's I think that's, that's what, what they've been trying to build, you know, mm -hmm. for a while, you know. And then, um, I see the media is trying to play a role, you know. Getting us, letting us know these players, you know. They're trying to do some kind of stuff. I don't know. Um, what do you think, like, what's the NFL right now? What do you feel about their improvements so far? Well, I don't see right any now. improvements in NFL, in NFL no. or whatever. NFL? NFL or whatever. The Amadou Picnic um, I don't government. See, no. I don't see any improvement. The only thing I see is that bunch of fans going to watch Nigerian. Nigerian <laughs> no, Nigerian of course, that's, that's, that's a yeah. improvement. You know? no, okay, fine. In, in that fans, aspect, maybe, maybe. But what I'm seeing is just a lot of committed players here. Yeah. They are representing the country even in and outside Nigeria, you understand? So, you know, like, you have a player like uh, Moses, let's take for instance Moses, Moses plays for Chelsea, you understand? So, to an extent, you're supposed to perform in your country. So, you come back with that determination because I want to win trophies. I want people to know that I actually can do this. It's not because of Chelsea or anything. I have it in me. So, it's just like a bunch of players that want to represent the country. That is what they are doing right now. And we have we have a lot of talented players, but the problem the problem is just how to combine them. And if they are willing, that willingness to perform is what we normally lack. So if the coach can, if we can qualify, I see them in that World Cup maybe qualifying for the group stage. The group stage, yeah. just the group stage. No, I said I, I I see them qualifying for the group stage. Okay. But after the group stage. Whatever happens, that local stage, yeah. whatever happens in that place, yeah. it's up to God. <laughs> because that is not that is normally our thing. After exactly. the group stage, we, like consistency. we meet Argentina and that is it. Okay, so you're saying um, most of the teams in the World Cup are going to beat Nigeria? Not not see? most of them, not most of them. Like I see them, if, if we can meet some of these countries that I don't know, I don't want to mention them, I don't want to disrespect <laughs> anybody. Yeah. So, but I can see them, they are the kind of team, the kind of squad you have right now, they are like we can beat most of these countries, you understand? Yeah. But you know Nigeria and well, are we are we the best in Africa? Mm. The, right now. Yeah. I can say right now, yes, somehow. Somehow. Yes. So you mean Nigeria is better? With the quality than of room. The, with the quality so of play, with the quality of players we have right now, okay. we are supposed to be the best. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We are supposed to be the best, yes. but we are not actually the best. We are not the current champions. My, in my opinion, I feel like we are actually that good, but we lack consistency. Okay. That's the only problem so, we have. So, so what, what um, can be done you know, to solve this? Like I said before, we just need to get our shit together. When players like you know, when the chemistry is there, that's what we need right now. If everyone can come together, you know, I pass to you, you pass to me, we understand each other, we can flow. Yeah. I mean, that's what we need on the football pitch. Right? What we need right now is to build a winning team. Mm -hmm. so, okay. It's not just a team that just come to play. Talking, about, really talking about building a winning team now, yeah. um, tell me your best true forwards. If you were supposed to, you know, make the team sheet for the Nigerian squad, who, who would you put as your best true forwards in a match? Best a very forward. serious match, yeah. First three forward. Yeah. I'm going to play three forwards. If you're going to play three forwards. Yeah. Okay, let's say um one forward and two and wingers. Two wingers. Like okay. Right now I have I have Ikalu because he's consistent. 
Is, is he consistent? Somehow. They say he's China made. Do you agree? I, I, I no, China, China, China. Okay, wait, China made because he maybe he plays for China or something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He, China made because he plays for China. Okay. okay. So I'll go for Igalo because why? Because if you watch his game, like the, the, most of the game is featured for the, for the Chinese club, you see that he plays. So he has a, a playing time. You understand? He plays constantly. Yeah. And then I won't go for um, the guy, uh, the Leicester City guy, Yana yeah. Chok, because even in the Leicester City, he's not even playing. Yeah, they are not giving him the playing time. Playing the so you don't know. The, you don't know if he's fit right now or maybe he just trying to build on his fitness. Mm -hmm. So I will go for Igalo because he's consistent. Yeah. He will be also consistent because he's, he plays yeah. regular. He's a regular yeah, starter yeah, for, for yeah. Arsenal right now. Yeah, come, so I'm going to come to you. We have some questions for you. Both. Okay. You guys have answer, but go on. So I pick those. Um, with the power Moses has now in Chelsea, yeah. you see that he's very good. From that way, if you're playing from that, yeah. way, from that way, so it's very good right now. So I'll probably go for Moses also. Yeah, and I also then, feel like Moses is like a two, flexible player. He can play like you know, right wing, forward, yeah. left yeah. wing, right back. Very yeah. Yeah. Very so good. with that, with when I have Egalo and Moses, and uh, uh, what's it? Yeah, I won't pick your third player. Um, I think Alex Moses. Oh. He said Alex will be, be, will be, will be um, Igalo and Moses. Moses yes. That's so I'll probably go for that thing. Okay, so how about you? Yes. Uh, I think I want to. I'm the same way. Yeah. Okay, that's, 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 that's going to Those be are like the players in the spotlight for now. Uh -huh. Okay, so you're going for the spotlight. Not just the spotlight, the ones that we can see. Yeah. You know, we can see the ability as well, you know, who's fit, who's not, like you said. Okay, talking about Alexander, who would be right now, he's getting, you know, so much playing time in the Arsenal, and what do you see? Are, is it going to likely be Nigeria's most achieved player in Arsenal? I mean, not just in Arsenal. I mean, he has a very long career ahead of him. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, what do you see for the future for him? Well, for the future, man, that's a difficult one. Mm -hmm. But personally, I feel like if he remains in Arsenal. It's well, good. Say, I don't really want to anger Arsenal fans right now. So <laughs> <laughs> I mean, do you care about Arsenal fans? Do you? Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm not a fan, but like you know, I care. You're a Barcelona fan, right? Of course. So why do you care? Come on, say what you want to say. You see, yeah, you don't care about. Them. I don't want it. I don't want to write off anybody, any club. No, you're not writing off. You're speaking for. Okay. 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 I feel like he's a good player actually. If he gets the uh, the amount of time he needs, like if he yeah. gets enough playing time in the team. I think we'll perform, you know, okay. but not to the level of, you know, world best and all that. So, um, do you say, is, should he leave us now? You know, at For now, he's vital to them. I don't think he should leave us now. I mean, he should get his development from yeah. there. Okay. Um, Iamacho, I mean, them buying him away from, Leicester City buying him away from Manchester City, and then he going there and getting the bench. I mean, what do you think about it? Well, if you look at Pep uh, Guardiola's team right now, you know that Ian as well doesn't have a choice. Yeah. He has to be. Because there is no way you're going to get playing time with that kind of ball. No, it's not you. possible. Now, so many people were expecting him that when he goes to Leicester City, he's going to perform in the top notch. And then we see him on the bench, he doesn't get playing time. Uh, well, I, I would say that one depends on the coach and yes. depends on what happens on the training ground. Understand? So maybe maybe the coach is thinking that maybe it's not the right time to do this or maybe he's not fit enough to fit in the squad. So they are still going to give him a little bit of time. Maybe to come up with a good something for him to play for them. To play for them. But right now you just need to give him time. He's growing, you understand? Okay. So he, he he's just a kid, so he's just trying to grow. Alright, enough with foreign football now. Now let's go to the home base football, the MPFL. Which team do you support in? I was I was supporting my people until they disappointed. Why are your people? <laughs> Why are <your> people? <laughs> Rangers. Hey, Rangers. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. They won the league. You know. Um, before. And then before the before before I could look at the table, they were <laughs> <laughs> they were in relegation zone. Exactly. And I was I was pissed. Yeah. So I had to go. Yeah. I said, what is all this? Yeah. We were happy for them. Everything was happening. We were, 
We were cheering them, we were praying for them. <laughs> but I haven't told people about you, the game. How can you do that? Rangers fans are going to be angry right now because just because of one bad season, you. It's, it's not a bad season. Very, very bad. It's not a bad season. So I can't call that bad season. How can you tell me from championship to relegation is bad season? That one is more than bad. Season. Very, very, very bad. <laughs> okay, you're telling me now. Okay, Chelsea just won the the the, the Premier League last season, and then you see Chelsea like Everton this season. <laughs> relegation zone. What would you say? That one is is more than bad season. Okay. I was supporting them, but how how come? I mean, I don't understand how it happened. Mm-hmm. So you lose, you keep losing, you keep yeah. losing, and you don't want to do anything about it. Till you find yourself in the relegation zone, it's too much. From championship, yeah. just like what happened to Nigeria, we won, we won the, the Nations Cup and yeah, we couldn't qualify for the. That's, that was, that's, that's embarrassing. That's crazy yeah, and it's very embarrassing. Okay, how about you? Is I think I'll go with him too because I, I used to support my people, Niger to lose because I'm from Niger State. Okay. So like a couple of seasons ago, when they won the following season, like I said, they didn't even just finish in the relegation zone. They finished last, <laughs> like last. <laughs> I mean, so do you have to? <laughs> so this this season you um this past season you didn't support anybody. Uh, to be honest, I haven't really been following up. Okay. This is current season. I've not watched any match. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Now um that's that's where I'm going to like um why aren't guys following the home base league? Why? What do you think? A lot of things. Like. Spirit. First of all, let's start from the pitch. <laughs> <laughs> Let's start from the kind of place they play their football. Okay. <laughs> okay. Be truthful to yourself. Mm-hmm. <laughs> On a Saturday evening. Yeah. When something is happening in London. Okay. Yeah. Okay, okay, now. Wait, 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 wait. Let's be let's be honest here. Yeah. I'm a Manu fan, yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, so it happens that Five o'clock okay, on the Saturday, they, on the Saturday. They, wait, 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 they aren't playing on Saturdays, they're playing okay. on Sundays. Really? Sunday okay, okay. Let's let us let us that let's create that scenario, yeah? I'm a Mario fan and Mario is playing on Sunday. Maybe they did not play on Saturday. <laughs> they are playing on Sunday. You expect me to leave Mario and go and watch? It depends, man. Or what? It depends, man. Let's be truthful to ourselves. For, for example, you know, most of these games have limited coverage. Now if you truly are a fan of your team, you would want uh, to go, I want to, I want to go to you Nigeria. Could, you, could watch, you could watch highlights. Yeah. Okay. okay, now. Of course, I do watch highlights. No, that, that that's, a, so that's where I found out that my team always lose. <laughs> <laughs> of course, I don't watch them all the time because I, because I have to do other things. Like, I have to watch other games. You understand? And when I create chance, okay. you understand, to be a good fan, I watch and then I found out that we lost at home. And then I see the I see the mess of what is happening. Yeah. You see players punching the referee. That doesn't make any sense. You understand? So what pisses me off most about the things is the poor organization. Yeah. You understand? The facilities. They're not just help. Based on what Kinsley was just saying now about me, the just referees. Funny. I mean, um, basically there's a complaint that they are not being paid very well, and that's why they're officially. I feel so like poor. yeah, yeah, support him because mm-hmm. like I mean, if you look at what they paid the players. Yeah. I mean. What we, what do you expect them to pay the refs? Okay. Uh-huh. So um, some fans I even hear that this play these refs don't even come to some games. Yeah, like there was this time I went to watch a match in Lagos. Yeah. Yeah, and the ref that was supposed to officiate the match he didn't show up, so oh. just called a random person. I don't, I don't know where the guy from. Like, Are you serious? They were begging the guy, you know, stuff like that. And it's illegal. <laughs> anyway, my people, my people, man, as you see, these two guys here, they have been nominated for Sports Personality of the Year in Ivan Frank Keeves. So, guys, um, can you just briefly tell us, you know, why they should vote for you? Because I'm going to put the link to the um, voting poll in the description of this video. So, tell us, come on. Oh, okay. Well, I don't know. You play football, right? Yeah, I play and football. Some other sports. Yeah, I play football. Yeah, basically, I play football. Yeah. And then, according to people, they say I'm good. <laughs> so, <laughs> uh, so, I don't know. Yeah. Because I don't watch myself when I play. Mm-hmm. I just do it. It's just something I like. Okay. So, so, it's just like something I do for fun. So, because people say you're good, that's why you should go for you? No, because I've also worked for. Uh, for NSA for a long time. Yeah. So I think 
the most one is the right. <laughs> 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 At least. At least. How about you, Is? Oh, why should they vote for you? Why, so, why should they vote for Kingsley? I mean, <laughs> I mean this thing is yeah, so hard. It, no, no, he's a very like tough competitor, so. obviously. I yeah. Mean, he's been here for a while. I mean, I mean you, you, you're not just football, you basketballer, you know. Yeah. You know the sports, I, mean. I mean, growing up, I delved into you know, lots of sports. You know, I, mean, I used to play tennis, even at the international level, I played yeah. with notes, yeah. basketball, football. I mean, I played football professionally, but I mean, Basketball is where I found myself and oh, nice. that's my age. Nice. I play for my school team, you know, we won lots of awards and everything. Wow, that's super crazy. <laughs> so, they should vote for you for that, right? Yes, yeah. of course. Yeah. Okay. But so guys, should man. come and take me international. <laughs> 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 Don't be buy, biased in your voting, man. Just vote for whoever vote, man. deserves it, man. And nobody should feel if you are the no, one. <laughs> Anyway, what do you have to tell Nigerians, man, football, seven years of independence, that kind of thing, based on our football level? Just tell them what to do. Yeah, what are people sharp, Nigerians? Sharp. Yeah. We, we are Nigerians and we keep being Nigerians. Forget all the distractions. Let's focus on building Nigerians. Exactly. Forever we shall start strong. We want Nigeria forever. No exactly. we are <laughs> No, 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 no. I didn't say that. I just said more Nigeria. I don't know anything. I don't know what he's talking about. Okay, how just about more Nigeria? Man? Yeah, I mean, if we should continue to support each other, one another, you know, in everything we do, wherever we go, we should recognize ourselves, you know. But Nigerians, I mean, one country, one love. One Nigeria. For me, man's not hard. The thing goes. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, my baby, my mother continues to follow us 42.com.ng for all latest of these news videos. Twitter, anything, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, everywhere, man. 42.ng. Yeah, yeah, you come yeah, out, man. We remain your yeah. outfit. Well, MTN, 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 everywhere you go. Cheers. You don't advertise MTN. <laughs> <laughs>